Hey guys, it's Diego from Spontaneous Vacationers. So today, we're gonna bring you along with us to Porto, Portugal. We got a chance to try the Francesina, which is composed of different kinds of meat and sausages, cheese, and delicious beer tomato sauce. We got to go to the Church of St. Francis, which is the most prominent Gothic monument in Porto. It's noted for its outstanding Baroque inner decorations, and it's located in the historic center of the city. Next up was the Torre dos Clérigos, which is a 75 meter tall and can be seen from various points of the city, and is one of the most famous symbols. We highly recommend the trek up those long and windy stairs. Hey guys, so we're in Porto Lisbon today, and the first thing you should do at daybreak is head to the Torre dos Clérigos Church, and it is about 5 euros per ticket, but definitely take the time and the money to spend to come up to the tower. It is a lot of steps, but it is well worth the view. It is just magnificent what you see on the top of this tower. So check it out guys, and we'll check you later. Bye! Porto's geography is hard on the feet, but pleasant to the eye. The city is extremely hilly, with many buildings built into a cliff that face and overlook the river. Before Lisbon was the capital of Portugal, it was Porto who held the title. Porto covers a total area of 41 square kilometers, which is 16 square miles. Typical Portuguese blue and white azulejo tiles decorate everything from churches and monasteries to palaces, houses, and train stations. It's beautiful. The city holds the nickname of Invicta because during the civil war of the 19th century, Porto was never conquered and even survived a year-long siege. It was elected a UNESCO World Heritage in 1996 because of its long history and ancient architectural buildings. The famous port wine is produced next to the beautiful Duoro River. It is stored and left to age in cellars. We suggest you visit these wineries. We got a chance to go to Ferreira Winery, Calem Winery, and Quinta do Noval Winery. Delicious, delicious wines. Porto left us stunned by its beauty. We cannot wait to go visit it. Definitely check it out, guys. Thank you for watching our video. Hit like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.